inside circle. Listen to me. And I know you've listened before. You've had the Secret Service call me. I've briefed him on stuff. I mean, he's, what? He's, I know the Trump inner circle does watch him, but... It is funny to think that, like, he's briefing the Secret Service. you got to take my supplements. I, I, I briefed yeah, yeah. Listen, I briefed the Secret Service. I told him a Chinese communist trans black woman was going to take shots. Moments away from hearing uh, President Biden. Uh, he is um, going to stand at that podium, and uh, we believe this is in Delaware. Let, somebody can confirm for me. Um, but he will address the nation about these events tonight in Florida, the shooting of that apparently wounded former President Trump, who is said to be okay. Uh, it killed a spectator, wounded another who's in critical condition. The shooter, who has not been identified, we know nothing about that person's background or what might have motivated him. That sh shooter uh, is said to be deceased as well. This story has been uh, rolling out, uh, and, and here is the president. Thoroughly briefed by all the agencies in the federal government. Damn, that was quick. Based on what we know now. I have tried to get a hold of Donald. Uh, he's with his doctors. Uh, they Apparently, he's doing well. I plan on talking to them shortly, I hope, when I get back to the uh, telephone. Look, there's no place in America for this kind of violence. It's sick. It's sick. It's one of the reasons why we have to unite this country. We cannot allow for this to be happening. We cannot be like this. We cannot condone this. And so, and I want to thank the Secret Service and all the agencies, including the state agencies, that have been engaged in making sure that the people who, and we have more detail to come relative to other injured, other people maybe injured in the audience. I don't have all that detail. We'll make that available to you. I may be able to come back a little later tonight, but we'll put out a statement if we don't, if I'm not able to give it, if it's not convenient for you all. But the bottom line is, the, the Trump rally was a rally that he should have been able to can be conducted peacefully without any problem. But the idea, the idea that there's political violence or violence in America like this is just unheard of. It's just not appropriate. And we, everybody, everybody must condemn it. Everybody. I'll keep you informed. And if I am able to speak to the to Donald, I'll, I'll let you know that as well. They're going to say he's so not far, calling him the president, as former one, presidents are normally called. Two, that they're thoroughly investigating what happened to anyone else in the audience. I have We have some reports, but not final reports. And every agency in the federal government, I'll be, and I'm going back to, to my phone to speak with the federal agencies that are being put together again to give me an updated briefing. Has anything happened? They learned any more in the last couple hours. So thank you very much, and I hope I get to speak to them tonight, and I'll get to, back to you if I do, okay? President, do you think there was an assassination attempt? I don't know enough to, I, I, have, I, have an, I have an opinion, but I don't, don't have any facts. Don't answer questions, Joe. So I want to make sure we have all the facts before I make don't some Don't answer questions, you don't you. do it. He almost, no he almost up. Um, we got tickets. We, we went to SneakerCon instead. Yeah, yeah. They, they, they got tickets for this rally. They were going to go, and then they're like, oh, it's just going to be kind of a shit video if we go. It's going to be boring. Uh, we don't want to fly all the way out the pittsburgh to do this and then they turned around with the <laughs> sneaker con instead i think what's what's really so content brain that i kind of feel like i've been broken up with you, know, oh, you, you yeah. visualize like a separate future of what and you could have been doing and more rounds. it's all yeah. gone right after that there's well, i mean it, you, five rounds. You, it would have been a dangerous situation you avoided uh, getting potentially shot side. at yeah. Seven jd vance is already blaming and, uh, biden uh, of course predictable was close I don't know the biden's campaign's rhetoric exactly led directly to president trump's attempted assassination yeah remember guys donald trump didn't do january 6 but if even if he did do january 6 those are Patriots. Also, Biden directly is responsible for the assassination attempt. It's such a. These guys have literally no decency whatsoever. First of all, Biden is a cadaver. Trump thinks Kamala Harris is. I mean, Biden thinks Kamala Harris is Trump. If he was going to kill anyone, it would. You wouldn't. You wouldn't know who it would be. Hi. Wait, how do you secure that Why out of her? How get back far up? do you go? Cover they shot, everything. They got the That's shooter. A, yeah, they, but that but that means there was a breach in security and people had weapons and like that seems so weird that he would get back up. Yeah, after dude. He, was, he got back up him? to throw up a fist because <laughs> because Secret Service W on that one. They were like, <laughs> yes, yes, Mr. President, go ahead, throw up your fist. <laughs> You're good to go. Dude, Israel bombs Damascus all the time. You guys are crazy. I'm sorry, but it's like a 
It's like a man bites dog versus dog bites man type situation. Okay? Like, chatters were like, dude, by the way, Israel's bombing Damascus is a crazy thing to say right now in this moment when the former president had an assassination attempt. Okay? When was the last time this happened? This is, is uh, this Ronald Reagan. Oh, well, other people have been, like, like congressperson has been shot. Uh, the, the third... Like the third in line, Steve Scalise was shot uh, at the congressional baseball game. But like last time, last time some like last time a president or a former president that's like running for re-election, last time a president was shot at was um was was Ronald Reagan. Ronald Reagan was shot at, and he survived. And um, I mean, like yeah, like. Someone attempted to fucking kill Bush, I guess, by throwing a shoe at him, but that's not it. <laughs> like, that's not what we're talking about. This happened like 50 years ago. Yeah. That's insane. Yeah, there was the Bush shoe projectile. But, like, American presidents have not, you know, have, have not had this uh, this kind of, like, a serious attempt at their lives in, in quite some what? time. Vice the, President the, Harris. The swiftness. Yeah. They're all these saying, like, we're glad he didn't die. Me, getting me in the car I don't know. I mean, that's it. That's what's going to happen. Gonna come. Like, so that's what trading. they're going to say. Like, no one's going to be like, I'm gl I can't believe the mother is. Like, no one's going to say that. You know what I mean? <laughs> if that's what you're expecting, like, I'm telling you, is not. Um, also, uh, the other thing, this is pretty funny. <laughs> people basically, <laughs> people basically are trying to say this okay the republicans that are coming out and being like this is because of biden's rhetoric are basically like unironically saying this meme is real okay biden was like ah no, we beat medicare someone was like thank you the manchurian <laughs> candidate was activated okay the manchurian candidate was activated is like oh yeah he said the the right sequence of words and it unlocked the part of someone's brain <laughs> anyway um no, there's no way a lib did this. <laughs> like, <laughs> I don't know. They did that's miss possible. those. Maybe that is pretty lib. Yeah. My brother texted me and said, this is a historically significant event. You should consider putting on a shirt. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no, it's fine. I got a right to bear arms, baby. It's the United States of goddamn America. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Trump attempted deep state assassination. Yeah, let's hear from this Gentlemen, guy. I told you that we're not in normal times. World War Three, nuclear war is this close. They just fired five shots at Trump and hit him in the side of the head. Aye. And the media's like, oh, big deal. He survived an assassination attempt. This is crazy town. Biden is a complete puppet. The new world order is melting down everywhere. And I believe they're getting ready to kill Biden and blame it on a Trump supporter. I've been saying that for over a year. So President Trump in Pennsylvania wait, so up you're there wrong. gets shot at, gets hit in the side of the head. So wait, sure. wait I've so, been saying the opposite. Yeah, I, you've been saying the opposite of what is about that, what just <laughs> happened. He's like, oh, I've been saying they're going to try to assassinate Biden and blame a Trump supporter. It's like, OK, well, then the exact opposite of that happened. So what do you what do you mean? He needs to pay the Parkland family. He's got to make that money somehow. Yeah, he's so cooked. Bro, that looks like neatly, lives, neatly trimmed hedges behind him. Like, what's going money. on? He's in a nice place. Yeah. How was yeah. he still at a nice house and shit? I thought he was done. Like, what's Provides that about? That image of him up there with the blood on his face defiant is incredible. And now the deep state that's committed all these crimes and opened the borders and human trafficked and started World War III, they are so desperate, they're going to go for broke. But I've told Trump, I've told his campaign, you've got to be more careful. we got to pray for President <laughs> Trump right now. It's it such a dangerous time. I'm me. in Northern California <laughs> with what would be a huge story breaking tomorrow, and it's still going to break. Massive story we're working on right now, okay? Secret mission. And it will still break it. But, ladies and gentlemen, this attempted assassination of Trump means we're not in Kansas anymore. And now they've tried to kill him with a gun. They're going to try to poison him. So, Trump, inside circle, listen to me. And I know you've listened before. You've had the Secret Service call me. I've briefed him on stuff. Listen to me. He's what? He's, I know the Trump inner circle does watch him. But it is funny to think that, like, he's briefing the Secret Service. <laughs> Like, okay, brother, sure. You gotta take my supplements. I'll bring it. Yeah. <laughs> He's like, yeah. listen, listen, I'll bring the Secret Service. I told him a Chinese, communist, Ukrainian, uh, 
Chinese communist Ukrainian trans black woman was going to take shots at the president. That's why I always take my anti-assassination pills. Yeah. <laughs> you can get them for $5.50. I told him. I told him, yeah. What the and we're in a period oh, of a few different well, streams never of information. Twice. Listen, what? lightning never strikes twice. You know what I mean? Like, he already survived one assassination attempt. He's probably good for, like, at least a year. You know what I mean? Like, I doubt. I doubt that he's going to get popped twice. That'd be crazy. Feel me? The king is talking. <laughs> said, I want to thank the United States Secret Service and all of law enforcement. He truthed. Okay, he's truthing right now. For the rapid response on the shooting that just took place in Butler, Pennsylvania. Most importantly, I want to extend my condolences to the family of the person that the rally was killed. And also the family of another person that was badly injured. This is an incre this, it is incredible that such an act can take place in our country. Nothing is known at this time about the shooter. I'm shocked that he didn't immediately say, like, this was a... Chinese Ukrainian black woman who's also trans like it's actually this is shocking I don't know if that the I don't know if that shot concussed him into like doing a normal thing all of a sudden but like this is a wild way to operate here nothing is known about the this time of the shooter and he's not speculating who is now dead I was shot with a bullet that pierced the upper part of my right ear I knew immediately that something was wrong in that I heard a whizzing sound, shots, and I immediately felt a bullet ripping through the skin. Much bleeding took place, so I realized then what was happening. God bless America. Let me finish that with God bless America. <laughs> God bless America. God saved him. Better resolution. The shooter was a right winger. I doubt that the shooter was a right winger, dude. Oh, don't do the, don't do the liberal version of what the, uh, the 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 Republicans are doing. I mean, I see it. Like I see the photo. And he's got one of those like grunt force video, uh, shirts on, okay? I mean, I got those as well. But like, yeah, he's got one of cool. those like grunt force ass shirts on. You know those like military larper yee -yee ass like shirts. Military fatigues as well. The pants are kind of like khaki. Khaki? Oh yeah, he you does. You guys don't a... say that. Khaki. Khaki. The Lord wants him to be president. Anyway, yeah, he was far. He was like, he was not a part of the, um, he was not a part of the, the rally. Like he was, he was on top of a container, which is crazy. That's a major L for the secret service for the record. Like actually. There's someone being up You there got the some homie time. with a rifle on top of a goddamn container taking pot shots of the president. Like it was a hundred meters away. That's not that. That's no. Okay. That all I'm saying, close. all I'm saying is this guy on the Tyler Oliveira video was right when he said someone's going to try to assassinate the president. Yeah. He said he six miles it. away, though. He said six miles that's away. A little bit closer. 150 meters, 400 feet. Imagine 50, though. It's like just more than a swimming pool. Yeah. Oh, shit. Well, there you go. Law enforcement snipers were already facing the direction of the shooter seconds prior to the shooting. I'm amazed they did not see the shooter crawling into position uh, for his and you know, shot. That's a, little a mere 400. Yeah, by the way, this is literally the reason why it's like so funny in in a very serious very obvious way this is hilarious to be like i can't believe the violent rhetoric <laughs> i can't believe the divisiveness it's like meanwhile this was on the f poster behind them like he was making arguments about how like undocumented migrants are coming in and invading the f country <laughs> and and doing like you know <laughs> doing violence and madness Senior reporter covering investigations at Capitol Hill for ABC says the shooter at the Trump rally fired as many as eight rounds from an AR style rival while perched on a rooftop adjacent to the venue. Law enforcement sources told ABC News the shooter was 200 to 300 yards away at the time of the gunfire. The sources Drink said um, this is where the shooter was. It looks like. Yeah, he was on top of these like container things. Yeah. It's such a massive space. But he's so Seeing close. Walking around. No, he's like literally looking right at him, which is crazy. Um, insane. Where's Mark, War Mark Wahlberg when you need him the most? How the f*** do they not have agents on the roof? Yeah, I don't really know. Anyway, uh, update from Secret Service is that uh, one has been killed and two is critically injured. Here's the latest information from our investigation. We're grateful to the Secret Service team and our law enforcement partners. During uh, President Trump's rally in Butler... Uh, Pennsylvania on the evening of the 13th of July at approximately 6.15 p.m. A suspected shooter fired multiple shots towards the stage from an elevated position outside the rally venue. U.S. Secret Service personnel neutralized the shooter who is now deceased. Mike Collins, GA. <laughs> the Republican District Attorney in Butler County, PA, should immediately file charges against Joseph Robinette Biden for inciting an assassination. Oh, my God. That's awesome. <laughs> <laughs> 
Dude, he's so he's right. I don't know if he knows this, but the Supreme Court made that legal, by the way. <laughs> it's gonna be alright, I think. Boardwalk already printed t-shirts. They are so shooting makes me stronger. <laughs> Bro, they didn't even think like yeah, just, they didn't even try to like come up with like a better statement. Or maybe they had it printed before. Yeah, it's an inside mm. job. Someone investigate those guys. Yeah. Hey, hi. Casey, uh, Dave, uh, wish, wish of course, we had gone on a better song. Literally, to what happened. Tell us what... 50 Cent posted it. Dude, he's coming out. There's so many cool songs he can use to come out <laughs> on stage now. Like, he could, he could literally... There are so many songs about being shot and surviving. Like, it's a very American genre. Who <laughs> shot you? He could come out with that. Um, He's going to sweep Biden. You're cooked. First of all, I'm cooked. There's nothing I could do. I'm not the Democratic Party. No way he comes out with his, comes out with rap with his base. Yes, he w The new Republican Party doesn't give a f that, dude. Elon Musk says two people have attempted to kill him over the past eight months. That's he's like, wait, so people like me when this happens? Yeah, <laughs> he's like, all the time. he's like, oh, Trump, someone tried to, someone tried to kill Trump. Only one person tried to kill Trump. Two people tried to kill me. It's like, yeah, people try to kill me all the time too, bro. You don't see me chirping about it like who gives it what do you mean you survive bitch <laughs> like <sighs> he's like damn dude that's crazy <laughs> yeah he just saw this and was like how can i make this about me <laughs> literally very normal things happening on x jews oh. try to assassinate why would they do that like in your world in your mind on what planet do you think Trump is like anti-Israel? Because I know when they say Jews, they're th they're talking like, oh, Israel policy, right? But like Trump is, this is so anti-Semitic, obviously, but it's also so unimaginably f stupid. Trump loves Israel. Trump is more popular in Israel than Joe Biden. What are you saying? The, dude, Modern <laughs> Nazis are in a state of panic. <laughs> they just refuse to recognize how much Trump glazes Israel. They're like, no, 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 he's our guy. He's I promise. Secretly, yeah. <laughs> uh, you have to admit the blood and the raised fist picture goes hard. No, I, have, dude, that's the brother. I saw him get shot in real time. I saw him get up in real time. That was the first thing I said. <laughs> I was like, it's so done. Yeah, it's over. Waiting. Pack it up. <laughs> the election is done today. This is the day that the election ended. Okay. <laughs> They're blaming the head of the Secret Service. Yes, DEI. They're saying it's a woman. <laughs> I shouldn't have put a woman in. Let's go, dude. Let's go. She was guarding bags of Cheetos. Is there a clip of your reaction? Yeah, it's both on my TikTok and also on my you're not hood. Stop trying to be hood, bud. What? Stop trying to be hood. What did I say? That's what? I think you said fam. Stop. I don't say <laughs> fam. This is. The, I. I never say fam. Why do they look at the director as if she has anything to do with like with no, the logistics dude, you don't of the day? She hates. She hates. <laughs> she said, "Guys, everyone underneath me do a slightly worse job." Yeah, that's, she's like, that's, "That's my policy." She said, "I'm a woman." And as a woman, I like doing womanly things, okay? <laughs> Which is doing my job, but worse. <laughs> this is the this is the um, the the twenty sixth direct twenty seventh director of the U.S. Secret Service. They're saying because she's a woman that she's doing a bad job. What do you want me to do? Take oh, this she was seriously? Head of global security at PepsiCo. Okay, yeah. that's a massive job. <laughs> yeah. Do you want that's... me to? What do you want me to do? Take this seriously? I'm sorry. Hold on, guys. Hmm. I don't believe that a woman secret service director is going to do a worse job. I do not believe that she was hired for the position specifically because specifically because she's a woman as implied by the right wingers. Hmm. Hmm. It's so funny that he said before, uh, like Elon Musk literally hires people like this personally. So he knows how solid they are you know what i mean it's like who's in charge of protecting you so before being put in charge of protecting the president she was guarding a bag of cheetos well someone good's in charge because apparently someone tried to kill elon musk twice yeah exactly so... i wonder it'd be real funny if we found out that like you know 
the the people in charge of Elon Musk's security team also worked at Pepsi, <laughs> like senior director and global security at PepsiCo. Also, yeah, he hired a woman. He hired a woman as CEO of Twitter. Fellow Aussie, think you and anyone who criticized Trump has blood on their hands. I love Rita. She's so good. Rita Panari. She's right. like a Sky every News. single leftist. Oh wait, this is the woman that is oh, this that, the, that, that she you. covered me. Yeah, 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 she yeah, covered yeah. me. Loony lefties. Loony lefties. Hassan Abbey. Came to Australia recently. Every single leftist from Biden to the CNN, the MSNBC and Washington Post, New York Times at Al, activists to the celebrities who have called the man leading the polls a threat to democracy and worse, have blood on their hands. Like, it's so funny how happy she is that he got shot. Like the first post, like, I got, <laughs> like, this is yeah, a beautiful moment. Yeah. <laughs> Did I, how was that accent? Oh. oh. I mean, only because there's a lot of people watching. It was very, very good. Yeah, it sounds really um, good. At, it's Australian. It's funny. My mum just called me and was like, "You need to get out of America." <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they're shooting everybody out there. Yeah. I mean, she ain't wrong. Like, listen, if they're shooting the president, like you know, yeah. you as a rando, you're not safe. Right wing narrative is clear. Um, yeah, they're just gonna say like, yeah, they're they're saying that like the left is responsible and that we should do to the left. What they tried to do to Donald Trump because they incited violence against Donald Trump by saying he's bad and scary. Uh, that's the only thing more tragic than what just happened is that if we're being honest, it wasn't totally a shock. Biden's inevitable ritual condemnation of political violence today, when it comes, will be insufficient and irrelevant. Dude, honestly, there is nothing funnier than people who are Trump supporters being like, Biden is so violent with yeah, his rhetoric. Yeah, yeah. And <laughs> like, he's so incisive with, yeah, with what he's, he's saying. So, you know, no, like, he's not. You know why he's not violent with his rhetoric? Because he don't know what the f he's saying half no. the time. Okay? Like, what do you mean? Oh, it's so funny. Ay, ay, ay. Biden can barely stand up. These like, he's so scary. <laughs> he's so scary. We know. When he says Trump is Hitler, it's like... That actually means, like, <laughs> he wants to kill Donald Trump. There is no conspiracy theory off the table now. The most powerful force in the world will try to do anything to stop Trump from being president. And why would they get that kid? Like, yeah, the, why would they yeah, get that, that the guy who, mi no, who that's, missed you don't understand. eight times? That, dude, that is such, like, a classic conspiracy theory take, by the way. Like, the the... You know, the Secret Service is all powerful and was, like, interested in killing Donald Trump. But also, they hired the guy who can't you know do a shot <laughs> like also like if it's a secret service they've got every other person who's so much closer to trump yeah yeah why don't they just like dart him like a you know like the kgb or some shit it just doesn't make sense are they tweeting this when it looks like he might be a right winger i don't think it was a right i mean i don't know but like it, it don't matter if it if that dude had a manifesto and was like i'm killing trump because i'm like further right than him i've <laughs> You know, it's still, that's they'd be amazing. like, oh, that's a fed. They would be like, that's a fed. That's federal government is a federal agent. He's on the payroll. He's trans. <laughs> like they'd be like, nah, he's, he's a, he's a Ukrainian trans Chinese Hamas guy who's Jewish. Joe Biden sent the you. orders. Democrats, dude, Marjorie Taylor Greene literally has a campaign ad where she shot a 50 cal oh, at a car. Okay, and I think the car literally had like the photos of Democrats on it. If I don't, if I remember, I might be misremembering, or it might have just said like the Democrats or something. And now she's like, words are violence. <laughs> you can't do that. You're Marjorie Taylor Greene. Like you're a a rabid sociopath. I don't understand it. Oh, here. Yeah. Yeah. We I saw think you showed it to us last year. Yeah. 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 Tweet, the tweet is about action, not words. Dude, there is no salvaging this, okay? Democrats wanted this to happen. They wanted Trump gone for years, and they prepared to do anything to make that happen. Justice Congress represented Tor Troy A. Carter, Barbara Lee, sponsored legislation to terminate Trump's Secret Service protection. Do you think, in all honesty, and I mean this with, like, so much sincerity, do you think Trump's Secret Service was terminated? Like, do you think Trump didn't have Secret Service? Do you think that Donald Trump has just been walking around without... Secret Service? I'm walking around with DEI Secret Service. Yeah. That's the real truth. That's why they lost. Like, they're on the videos all over. Didn't say that. Boy, boy, getting on that Indiana Jones. Dude, I love, I love Republicans. I, I'm so glad that this, I'm so glad that this brought back all the Trump supporters because they're always like trying to debate on the dumbest virtues 
on the dumbest talking points of all time where they're like, they didn't mean that. They're actually secretly plotting to assassinate Donald Trump. That's why the Congress actually did this. And they successfully... She was saying they tried to, I guess. I don't know. It doesn't matter. Okay? Because they failed. That's not why this happened. More pets. I know. It's exciting. I love American conspiracies. Best headline you know, ever. Yeah. Biden makes statement after Trump rally shooting. It's sick. That's what I said. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's sick, dude. That's what he said. <laughs> also, here's the three right now. Twitter AI is getting all the headlines wrong. Oh, dude, this is always funny. Vice President Harris shot nation reacts. Actor Home Alone 2 shot oh, at Trump good. rally. That's good. Trump rally incident, an ode to Jodie Foster. Wait, why is Jodie Foster a thing? Is this a main Oh, okay, that makes sense. That makes sense. Because Jodie Foster, so um, the guy who shot Ronald Reagan and failed oh, to kill to him, it wanted to impress uh, Jodie Foster. Hinkley. Yeah. It was Jodie Foster's stalker. It's happening already? <laughs> no. <laughs> President Trump, I await command. Small, weak, gay, liberal man destroy country. Try to attempt to assassinate. Not allow. All small, weak, liberal gay men will perish at the hand of Manchu. Civil war immediate. This is the Chinese guy the media was referring to. <laughs> All three of you, Zin, on upper or lower? Upper, upper deck. I didn't do Zin. All right. Is there anything new happening? Or are we... Anyone else got shot? <laughs> or... <laughs> Here. Joe Biden abandoned Americans in Afghanistan. Got 13 of our best soldiers killed. Best. Gave it. <laughs> I can't get over that. It's like, those were our best soldiers. Like, if they were the shittiest soldiers, I wouldn't care. But those were our best soldiers, okay? Kill list of Americans to the Taliban and armed an Islamic terrorist nation with $83 billion in weapons like this one. Biden should be impeached. Now I'm doing a gun giveaway of my own, but for Americans only. I want you to win this. Oh, man. Awesome. God damn it, dude. I'm a part of the Taliban, and I was really excited. I'm a big Marjorie Taylor Greene fan. 50 caliber rifle that Democrats will ban if they keep the House next year. While Joe Biden broke America's pledge to never leave a man behind, Nancy Pelosi is sneaking the Green New Deal into the $3.5 trillion dollar budget. And in 2022, I'm going to blow away the Democrat socialist agenda. Dude, Dude someone, yeah. need, okay, someone, someone needs, needs to f make this <laughs> into the Trump shot. Someone needs to cut Trump on the other side going, ah! <laughs> My you shoes. have to do this. <laughs> oh, she's oh, all right. Yeah, it's not that bad. Go to the oh, website sure. below and sign up. To Greengun.com. I wonder who won. The guy. The, the guy. Shooter. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The yeah. shooter. <laughs> nah, dude. If it was if it was the shooting Trump cow. with a 50 yeah, cal, yeah. the entire podium behind him would have been <laughs> pink and purple <laughs> sprayed. Marjorie Taylor Greene could be disarmed by a Kong full of peanut butter thrown down a hallway. <laughs> yes. What is that? Chew toy that you can put peanut butter in that dogs like. Uh, oh, that guy won the gun? Wait, you, you know, know him? Damn. You know that guy? <laughs> no, but they don't even give him the f scope. Like, what the hell? That's kind of ass. Yeah, that's pretty mean. Anyway.